Neat. Anything interesting? I'm looking, I'm looking. Some kind of surveillance room. Come on, let's take a look. Physically, she's symptom free. Now, that's a big improvement. Otherwise, no change. Why am I looking at this? We're not improving the treatment, we're perfecting it. What the client is expecting, it's. This is the type of project that requires a lifetime of research. Now, the progress you see is. If you can't meet the deadline, Doctor. You'll be replaced. Put this one with the others. Experimenting on zombies. Imprisoning them. But what for? For observation. They're trying... ...to create something. Shit. Frank, we're gonna stop these assholes, right? <laughs> whoa, whoa. We get the story, we get out, we get paid. That's what we do. That's all we do. Something you want to say? Always. Shit, this door is code locked. You can hack the code with your spectrum analyzer. Let me guess. You messed with my camera again, right? You're a quick one. Uh, that's what she said. I've never seen a zombie freak out like this before. God, Frank. Look at her. She's suffering. Yeah, and the only way forward is through this chamber. Hey, ugly. That's no good. Interesting. Barbecue. No? No one? Holy shit, Frank. This is some atrocity level shit going on here, and the best you can do is crack wise. That is unfair. I have photographed things and thought about things. You don't actually care what's happening to these people, do you? Look, let's just get what we came for and get out of here, okay? Okay. You know what this is? Yeah. DNA test results. Their faces are all the same. Yeah. Big family, you think? Shut up. There's something in there. Try your spectrum analyzer. It should be able to see inside. It's another one. What are these bastards doing? They're cloning people. Manufacturing fodder for zombie research. 
experimenting on them, imprisoning them. Vic, this story's gonna win us every award on the planet, so please, please, just stay focused long enough for us to get out of here. I'm not going anywhere. I'm gonna burn this place to the ground. That's someone crying. Vic, we have what we need. Let's go now! Vic, stop! What are you doing? Now you put us both in danger. You were just gonna leave her? Just use her? We for need to what? get out of here. Do you understand me? But your pictures! Your stupid pictures! I'm a reporter, Vic. That's what I do. I report. And if you can't do the same, if you can't take yourself out of the picture, then you should get the hell out of here! Oh shit. Go, go, go! Five seconds in there. Huh. Maybe there's something out here I can use. I think I can make sense of this. Shit. Holy crap!
think this is the gate controls. Looks like another... Code lock. All right, you meatheads. We've got an intruder tearing up the place, and the commander wouldn't be very impressed if we just let it happen. So shut up, suit up, and clean up. Understood? Sir, sir yes, yes sir. sir. What's happening? Take him down! Take him down! You know? Oh, look at that. My bad. Yes? That depends. On? How well you work with others. Oh, well, shit, that's never been my strong suit. <laughs> Just kind of stuffy in here, don't you think? A little fresh air, you know? <laughs> It seems I have some time on my hands. What do you want to talk about? Uh, I know who you are. Colonel Brad Park, commander of the ZDC. I'm up on my zombie news, thank you very much. Of course you are. Well, then you also know that the ZDC's mandate is to respond to zombies on U.S. soil. Yes, and confine and silence anybody who knows the truth. Well, I'll up on it, thank you. It's happening again in Willamette. What is? An outbreak. I didn't see anything on the news. How long has it been going on? Going on six weeks now. Really? It's a long time to silence an entire town. Not for them. Who? Oh, the Pentagon. Oh, shit. What did you see there? You know what I saw. Nobody knows, Frank. The only reason I found out is because somebody screwed up and passed me a top-level report. 
This reservist training center, I have yet to see anyone who's actually stationed there. All communications in and out of the town are gone. Now the satellite photos have been updated in four months. It is being covered up. But <clears throat> all that pales in comparison to the mystery of why you, Frank West, are teaching a goddamn night class instead of being two steps ahead of me on this. I quit. You quit? Yes, I quit. Do you know how many outbreaks I've been part of? How many I've covered? And what thanks have I gotten? Huh? Nothing. No thank yous, no flowers, just a contact book filled with dead people. National Headline Award 2006. You exposed the first zombie outbreak on US so I photographed the whole thing. You got some medals, a few letters behind your name. Honorary, of course. Yeah, but let's get to the point. Three weeks later, I tried to expose the Pentagon and the entire U.S. government for their involvement with it, and they buried me! Because you didn't have sufficient evidence. You come with me to Willamette. We expose this bullshit. And you do it right this time. Frank. Frank, there's a lot more at stake here than just one town. No. I'm out. Whoever breaks this, they're in for some big gains. Maybe even win back something. But actually, I'm surprised that you let an amateur rip this up from under you. What the hell are you talking about? This is one of your students, isn't it? Oh. Uh... Thank you. Whoops. <clears throat> Vic. Mm. Hell of a team you've assembled. Coming up on Willamette. Get a squad out there. Capture or kill, your discretion. Frank! 